Look alive, everybody. Matt Ray is seven seven is in the house and welcome to Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. For anybody who watched the first episode of Assassin's Creed Freedom Cry 1, I will be getting back to that series hopefully soon. And two, you know that I love Assassin's Creed Black Flag. For those of you who don't, you play as Edward Kenway, a pirate who dreams of making it big. Not necessarily as a pirate, but making it big so he can go home to his, to his, not his wife, his girlfriend, I'll say, uh, back in England. But you know what, that's a different story, and I will not be doing the story for Assassin's Creed Black Flag. I will be doing the story for Assassin's Creed 2, Brotherhood Revelations, and now that I have Origins, I might be doing it for Origins. I might not, though, so, yeah. Anyway, in this game, you get to go around and destroying ships, like an actual pirate would. Unfortunately, there's no walking the plank, but then again, that, that didn't exist, that was just a make up, made up myth. Anyway, we are in a place called Nassau, it is pretty much the main place for pirates in the game, so it's pretty much Edward's home in this game. However, before we can set sail, we have a job to do, a test, I guess, of, e of Edward's abilities in combat. So, we need to go and kill some dude who's been being a bit nasty to other people on the ocean. This bloke here, the one that has the red dot above him and has kill written on top of it, this guy has been a bit mean to people and he has been acting like he's the boss of the seas. Yeah, let me just show him that he is most definitely mistaken. Oh, for God's sake, the guy's leaving. He must be looking for someone. That's the only option. Oh. Nobody's ever gonna find him now, he's just gonna be dead in the bush forever. Okie dokie, so now we're back on the seas after getting yourself a little bit of a profit. So, uh, let's go and stir up trouble, shall we? <laughs> that was say Andy Climatics. Okay, let's start off easy. Let's board this little shit ahead. Okie dokie, so we gotta try and take care of this ship without getting ourselves killed, so... Try not to destroy the ship either, that would be a problem. Now, for the boarding process. You gotta take care of each one. Okay, well, that was quick. We now have the ability to choose what you want to do with what's left of the ship. So, uh, my ship is more important than their ship. So let's go and take their stuff for ourselves. And, of course, destroy their ship. If you thought that that tiny amount of loot that we got from that ship was enough for me, you were sadly mistaken. We have more to get. And conveniently, we've run into a we've run into a bunch of schooners who are in this restricted area, which means that we can take them easily. Let's try and cause some havoc by blowing up the ship with the swivel, shall we? Oh, that did something, but I mean, it's more fun to get onto the ship itself and take care of it. These guys are useless. They should just leave. Don't even. Oh God! Don't even bother. He just got shot in the back. That's a no good way to go. Getting shot in the back. Uh, he just got killed by being kicked against the steering wheel. I'm not sure which is worse. And once again, we're going to repair our ship. Fire away, lads. This schooner here just signed its own debt warrant to chew out some barrels into the sea. I shot the barrels, and the barrels exploded. Ha, nearly destroying the ship. So, it's time we finish the deal. Okay, you could have swung a bit forward on that rope. Hello, lads. Do you want a party? Oh, I can just botch these guys. Seriously, these guys are just literally the equivalent. It's like cutting paper, seriously. And then they've torn into pretzels after I killed them. And we are done here. After a decent plunder, it's always good to come home to somewhere safe. The Andreas Islands, they're the perfect place. I'm gonna get myself a drink. Oh, hang on. Oh, hold on a second. Hey! What was that for? Looks like we have some trouble with us. No, 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 get the, uh, get the band to keep playing. It's fun beating people up to the sound of their music. Uh oh Can I not just kill them? I can't, I don't think. I don't, I don't know if the game will let me. Will it? It won't. Well, too bad. It doesn't make a difference though, I'll still break their necks. Let's go get me a drink. I'm quite torsy after all that plundering and fighting. And see what I ain't great either. Right, so some rich fella is looking to make himself even more rich by finding a valuable artifact, unvaluable artifact located on this island. So obviously that means you have to kill him. The hood is now off. We are going in full stealth mode. So we need to try and remain as quiet as possible if we want to do the best in this job. I found a man. 
And he seems to be giving out rewards to the men who find him the thing. Oh, Jesus. Nope. Damn it! I wanted to make it a quiet job. Eh, well, it won't make a difference anyway. It's more fun this way. Because you get to do more cool stuff. Look like this. Ooh, yeah, I'm just going to shove him in there. Only these two guards know this, so I'm going to put a bullet in this guy's head. Flawless. You know, while I may not be able to find the treasure that that man was looking for, because he probably already took it, and we didn't bother to loot him, there is other treasures out there, and conveniently, I have a few treasure maps. So here's the fourth treasure map. 749625 are its coordinates. It happens that the location is quite far away from where I am right now, but it won't take too long to get there. Well, this location also conveniently happens to be the same place where the mission that I have to do next is at. But that's not what we're here for. We're here for the treasure. According to my map, it looks like we're at the location. Ah, what's this? This seems interesting. I think we're onto something, boys. A chest. Let's see what's inside. And what do we find? A plan. And 3,000... 3,000 rounds! I also got myself a figurehead, which is pretty cool. Ah, uh, look, another poor sod. Well, do. And how. Ah, another map! Uh, four, four, two, one, one, eight. The cycle continues. We're back in Nassau, and with the money that I've gotten myself, we're gonna buy me some shit. Okay, guys. How do I look? Fortunately, I was getting a bit tired of wearing the same old robes. Well, in technicality, I'm still wearing the same robes and just wearing a cool cloak over it. There's like a bit of a sea battle that's going on between the British and the Spanish. Oh, well, let them take care of themselves. Hang on. Why is this ship here? Why is, what happened to this ship here? It's just... It's just sitting there. It must have been attacked or something, but... I mean, we don't know why it's here. We might as well go and take advantage of it anyway. Because that's what pirates do. Can I not board it? Oh, I know what this is. This isn't a, uh, boarding ship. This is a loot ship that's been scuttled and that we have to loot just for the place to close up. Well, that didn't work out, did it? I think I want to tackle one more ship before I go and look over here. Waiting for me to challenge her. A brig. What's it called? Barca de An Antique. I'll have to translate that on Google Translate, but apart from that, it's grand. Tailor it sails. Right, now, ram it in the ass. Okay. Brigs are trickier to handle because they're much tougher than uh, schooners. And I hope to God that's alone, because that would be a problem. You've got to be kidding. We have a hunter ship now after us. Uh, let's just hope we can take care of this ship first. They're not showing the barrels. Oh, right, they can't. Okay, we have to take care of this brig before this ship here gets to us. Because this thing there is another brig. I wouldn't be able to handle two of them. Come on! Oh, bollocks. Fire! Hope to God that that ship, that hunter ship. Oh no. Hang on. Hang on! Ow! Ow, that was right, right, right on the weak spot. Getting for some broadsides. Jesus. Oh great, half of my shot ship is bloody water. We have to destroy this thing quickly before I get sunk. Oh shit, hang on. Mm, that missed. That didn't. Ow. Quick, hurry up and destroy that ship before it destroys us. Come on. Ah, oh, no, I'm so close to death. This is not good, this is not good, this is not good. Come on, I need to destroy the break fast. Ow. Come on, yes, I got it, I got it. Let's board this ship before we get destroyed by the other ship. Now this is going to be a tougher fight because there's a brig and the brigs, they don't go down easily. You need to kill 10 of these dudes and hopefully don't lose all my crew in the process. That would not be nice. Uh, okay. Uh-oh. Ooh, Jesus. Also, I upgraded my sword when I was doing that shopping as well. 
you know, he fell over. Kill the guy who fell over, yes. Let's call some fireworks, shall we? Should be fun. Oh yeah, kill him. And, okay, that was pretty anticlimactic, but still, we took the ship. So now what are we going to do with this? Let's repair this ship. It won't be able to last much longer if we don't. Of course, we still have this thing to deal with. Thankfully, we took care of some of its health that when we were in the fight with the brig. So hopefully, if we're lucky, we should be able to take advantage of everything. You know, all things considered. Also, I forgot, there's another brig that, have, that is coming into the area. I don't need to deal with that. No, thank you. Come on. Throwing a fire barrels and directly onto the enemy ship does the most damage. Of course, you have to be at really close range for that to happen. Face! And now... Come on! Hit the weak spots! That does the most damage. And try not to... And come on, fire! That didn't work. Uh, we have to try and destroy this thing before that brig finds us and that brig is found as fuck. These guys aren't necessarily Spanish or English, they're the Navy. Meaning that they should probably be better dressed, but I mean, they are, they're hunters. So they're gonna try and kill me no matter where I am or who I fight. Meaning that I have to kill them first. What the hell is happening? Oh god. Ooh, Jesus, I could have cut his head in half, ow. There's the job already. Oh. Well, we just took our navy ship. Right. Let's repair the jackdaw. And of course, destroy the ship in the process. Anyway guys, that does it for this episode of Assassin's Creed Black Flag. It was quite fun. Messing around, killing people. And plundering ships and stuff. So, if you did enjoy it, of course, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you later.